Then you can just lie on it. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. Wow. Welcome to what to buy our travel essentials. Woo! I just want to say that me and Lingyi fought about to recommend the same few items. I start first, huh? Okay. Let's go. Before we share, right, what was the last country you visited? Melbourne. Melbourne? Yeah. That's Australia. Australia. <laughs> You're very Chanel, eh? <laughs> okay, alright. What was the last place you visited? Okay. Um. Solid? Solid? You saw Solid? Australia, right? Perth. Yes. Go you also another Chanel. <laughs> Alright, let's go then travel okay. to Queen Janetto. My first travel item is very useful for long haul flights, okay? Okay, so this tur this turtle pillow, right? It looks very different. So you know normally you buy the blow up kind, right? Then it's like just yeah. very kawaii. Yeah. And it's very difficult to sleep with, honestly. Correct. And it's very unhygienic because you cannot put it in your bag. So you always either clip or you have to carry, oh, right? Oh, that's true. Yeah, right. if you don't carry your I don't carry a super big bag. Uh. So this one right helps you sleep. Let me show you. Number one. <laughs> Number one, this is very wash easily washable. Uh. So you can detach this velcro, then inside is the hard plastic, right? Uh -huh. Take it out and you just throw this in the washing machine. So right, how you sleep? You ask, this is your question, right? Yeah, how you yeah. sleep this, right? You put like that. Then you wrap. Wow, it's very size friendly also. Eh. You look like an injured dog who's not allowed to lick your then, balls. You know when you sleep, right? Your head always like droop down, right? <laughs> you look like this. I don't care who laughs at me as long as I get a good sleep on the plane. I can knock out, right? From Singapore to London, 14 hours, right? I sleep all the way. Like that? Yeah, because in economy, right? It's dead uncomfortable. Uh -huh. And then this one, when your head naturally droops down when you're asleep, this one will crack. <laughs> Bro, 14 hours of sleep is not the pillow. It's Sorry, you. I was sleeping and I didn't hear you. <laughs> she wants to sleep beside me on this long haul flight. I don't even Hey, you took a wrong haul, <laughs> It was long. Oh. <laughs> it's a good item, okay? Why it's do you want to It's a good item. I look like this uh, British, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, which brings me to my next item. This is actually not an item, la. it's an app. Oh, nice! It's an okay. app. I know exactly what it is. Really? Okay, this app is called Splitwise. It's a basically an app. You know, like for example, like whenever you and your friends travel, right? Then it's very hard to like count money. Yeah. So it's an accounting app where you can create a group chat. So for example, at I, of a, yeah, of I, I I don't know your friend. So I start a I can create a group chat. Let's say I create a group chat. Uh, let's say we go Japan, ah, okay? okay? I categorize as a trip my two friends, Yashora and uh, Amelia, okay? And then I have to go settings and this is the best function. It's called Simplify Group Debts. So for example, I owe Lingyi $10. Uh. Lingyi owe you $15. You owe me $10. It will simplify. It will calculate. And simplify the debt so that we don't need to pay three times. We only pay one time. Oh! So for example, you enter a description, right? Let's say I just put uh, food. La. I, I, she, I buy food. Then I put like maybe $50. I can change the currency also from Singapore to whatever. So let's say we are in Japan, right? So I change so the Japanese yen. In. It will record in yen so that it's easier for us. How I want to split. So I paid by me and I want to split within three of us or do I want to split only me and Yashara? And then for example, like uh, let's say your friend never pay you, right? Your your trip ends but still got life over money. You can send alert? Yeah, you can send alert. Are you speaking? <laughs> yeah. You can send alert. Wow! Yeah! But I wish they changed the Priscilla Lim as you set up to like split wise is gently reminding you yeah. so, so that it does not look like I initiated so the So calculative, yeah. I didn't want to be so secretive, know. right? Okay, this is, this is good, this is good. Better than the next, so you know? Lit. Thank you. Now, let's move on to Ling Yi. This one, first one is an app, okay? Okay, it's actually not an app, it's a service that M1 provides. Their usual data roaming service is by month. So you pay, let's say, 12 bucks to like even 60 bucks per month, then you can roam uh, using your local data, the data you already pay for. Uh. Also, if my plan got 100, yes, I can use the 100. Yes, you can use the 100 overseas. But they recently introduced a product that I think is quite convenient, it's quite good. It's called Daily Passport. So every day, it's a few dollars only. The lowest is 295 and they give you 3 GB. You can share as well. Yeah, I guess it's really useful yeah. when you don't travel for a long period of time, yes. just a few days. Uh, this is extremely suitable for like a two-day travel. You know, yeah, Singapore, yeah. we go to like Bangkok for two days. Yeah. You don't want to pay like, I don't know, 30 bucks for the entire roaming. You just yeah. pay for two days. And uh, 3 GB, I think, is enough per yeah. day. Oh, are... it's 3 GB 
per day. Uh. Per day. It's yeah. a per day thing, so the package goes by per wow. day. Really. It was cheap, cheap GB for the duration. <laughs> it is damn good. Eh. Yeah. So as you can see here, so this is a daily passport for Thailand. Thailand is two ninety five a day. So that's a very pro good product. They just recently launched, and then if you use with your family, that's even better. You can hotspot. That's the yes. That's yeah. a good. Because some people don't allow hotspot. Cannot. Yeah. yeah. What is very good, huh? Yeah. Wow. My second travel item requires a lot of uh, salesman um, ship. So this what is, a... is <laughs> this is a sarong. Uh huh. Okay, and I have it not because I'm a sarong party girl. It's because I bring this to most of my travels. So most of my travels, <laughs> what what? Okay, let me let me just sell it. Okay. For example, if I go to Philippines or Thailand, most of my travels are by the beach and or on a boat. I travel with a backpack, right? So I will not bring a jacket. I will not bring blankets. I will not bring towels, hats, scarves, right? So this, first of all, when you are cold, you open it on the plane, right? Then you wear this, all right? It's even big enough for two person, yeah? And then, if it's sunny by the beach, right? Then you don't have a hat. You know, stylish. More cool, is it? Stylish, stylish style. And, and, on the beach, right? There you go. And you can just lie on it. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah? Wow. And then, places where you can't bring a towel. Towels are very hard to dry. This one dries you very fast. Second of all, it dries on its own super fast. So you dry this. Dry yourself with this and then so you just put in the wing. Purple sarong. Yeah, yeah. So wait, wait, where you bought this and how much it was? I don't know, something two dollars. It's outside of a temple of Indonesia and also it's a stylish skirt. Yeah? In dinghy defense, my mother always uses a sarong whenever she travels to a hot climate. Yes! To be fair. Hey, you know what else this is? Oh, damn! <laughs> this is actually, you see? I mean, I bring a backpack lah, so my clean clothes and my dirty clothes are all in the same bag. Yeah. Or I just don't have a plastic bag this last day. But then you use it for dirty clothes, that means when you take a plain bag, you don't have the neck below. You won't don't have, have, a blanket. have a blanket. Short trips ma. <laughs> <laughs> I would say this is quite a, quite a useful product. Ah. Okay. okay. I suddenly don't feel like bringing out my items because I feel that my items are so superficial. <laughs> it's okay, you see, we need. Sometimes you need like a not so smart choice, right? Okay, okay, can, can, can. Okay. So this is a really good. Oh um, my god, I know this. I've been wanting one. Pouch. So this one is really great because it helps to contain all my makeup that I need for travel wise in a very compact area. Of course, Same. it's not like super small, but. It does the trick because whenever we go to hotel rooms, right, their lightings are really, really uh, warm lights and it makes you feel comfortable, but it's not the most suitable lighting for makeup. So this one will allow you. Oh. To so it can change the different lighting mode as well. And then if you press and hold, you can actually dim the light. Another thing that I really love about this is not that it's only compact. You might think that, oh, this one puts your luggage. They got a lot of space. Uh, you can slot on it top. on top of your luggage. Whoa. Asi, where is this from? Ah? This is from by Cass. Okay, and then of course she did a little bit of advertisement here. Like I can scan the QR code. <laughs> if you want to purchase it, then um, you can check it on their website. You know the thing inside, right? The the dividers. Can... Yeah, it all it's all included okay. in this bag. Alright, that's so okay. Good. So this is item number one, very straightforward. Item number two also very straightforward because I have these two antenna that I cannot live without, and also my bags. So um, whenever I travel, I try to travel light. I don't want to carry my entire straightener. So I happen to chance upon this mini straightener. I think this is not like very new to a lot of people, but this is one of the better ones that I found. Hot enough to straighten maybe first two layers of my hair. And also you can do like a little bit of styling lah. Also like, you know, to curl my bangs. Even in between like, you know, shows or events where I need to touch up my hair. This one really saved my life. Yeah. So it's very light. But because it's small, right? And it, 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 it's heated. It's quite hot when it's heated. How much is this? Maybe like $5.99. Okay five la. Like five it's, a, five it's a very fast thing. free kind of. Yes. And kinda it helps like in between touch ups or, you know, you need it for a quick fix of, of your hair. This I can do a curl because the edges here are rounded. Yes, it's perfect. Okay. 
Okay, now that we've seen all the products, right? What do you all think is the best product that was shown so far? I, I, I think it's the app that you mentioned. I think Splitwise really does a lot of, uh, really, really help to split the money wise in a more friendlier manner. <laughs> My favorite is actually the, the, the makeup bag. The sun? Yeah, I think it's really so good. Eh. Really, man? You also don't use makeup? Hello, like nobody wants to give any comments on my recommendations. You <laughs> recommended a piece of cloth, eh? And, and the Data Daily Passport. Oh, that one is really yeah, good. Yeah, that one is good, la, but, but that's not my favourite. No, but I really think it's a great app. Yeah, it's a great app. Okay, that's it for today's Travel Essentials What to Buy episode. And let us know in the comment section below that what do you recommend us to buy or to bring for our next travels. And like, share, subscribe, and see you next time. Bye! Bye.